get 10 more points. Okay. I mean, we're looking decent right now, but nothing too, too crazy. this thing we yo 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 everybody what's going on is Lodis here back with another nordic ashes run hopefully y'all have been enjoying the content if so make sure you guys tap that like button down below and if you guys are new to the channel don't forget to subscribe down below Greatly appreciate it. it. Helps me out a lot. Let's me know that you guys are enjoying the content and willing to come back and watch some more. You guys can also tap that bell notification to get notified when a new video goes live, as I do upload every single day. And you guys don't want to miss out. Without further ado, let's jump right on into this. Um, in the last episode, we ended up running um, half cream, and we ended up dying, um, like toward the end of the boss, which kind of sucked. Um, we almost had it. Um, tried to avoid, but uh, we just ended up getting hit, which was just a little, a little unfortunate. So um, that was definitely a bummer. But hey, is is what it is. Not the end of the world. Um, we'll get it next time, I guess. <laughs> um, but the good thing is, is that we did unlock um, new character. So we did unlock um, missing over here. <clears throat> this guy. He is interesting very 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 interesting so in each run missing will randomly generate the following elements constellation number up in type of hearts two positive stats one negative stat enemies you touch will be teleported away from you <clears throat> so I, I think this is going to be a very very interesting run to say the least i don't know how well it's going to go um i don't even know how we're gonna necessarily play this character because it just seems like um it just seems just very different compared to what we've been running so we'll see um but the cool thing is once we did unlock him this character appeared as well dance to the most famous cheat code in the realm of video games it will give you the answer so we'll see if we can somehow unlock him while we um <clears throat> run missing on normal in Midgard and see how see how well this goes this will be interesting so what is it it's like up up down down left right left right hey chaos it's the most famous cheat code in the realm of video games it will give you the answer cool <clears throat> so it does look like we spawned with ivy which i'm i'm oh oh ivy's actually the main <clears throat> the main one okay I'm, I'm i'm okay with that um you get poison bomb daggers revna cards okay um very increased damage you inflict by 2.5 percent each time you receive damage from any source your attacks have a chance to apply poison increase movement speed Ooh. I think I'd go with poison. Um, then this one, attack speed. And you get a green heart every 50 seconds. Well, we definitely want this one. Um, this is actually insane. <clears throat> because you, you just spawn with whatever. Ooh. Duration area is huge, but minus 5 experience kind of sucks. That is definitely unfortunate. Okay. I mean, we are on normal mode of Midgard, so I'm, I'm not really too worried about how, um, how things are going to go. Um, we did get some interesting uh, um, relics, I would say, I guess. Um, I'll definitely take that. Like, it's nothing too bad. It's just <clears throat> interesting what we got. So, we'll see what we got going on here. We got our way up here. 
something good. Attack speed, I mean, sure. I mean, I don't think it'll be too good for what we're doing. But I'll take it, I guess. Um, I don't know if I want to go all in on Ivy, though. I'm kind of thinking going daggers. Daggers or poison bomb. It's like, those two are definitely, like, one settle. Like, anything that gets by the flowers, like, those will do work, man. So I'm kind of thinking going, um, going poison bomb. I mean, they're both good. They're both good. I think I'm leaning more towards poison bomb, though. We'll see how that goes. That'll be interesting. To say it the least. We'll see, though. <clears throat> we will see. Okay, so... I mean, we got an attack speed. Um, monolith. We got this guy I'll take. Um, and we got movement speed. Okay. Boom. Increased damage, I'll definitely take that. Definitely take that. Both not bad. Yeah, one more altar. Turn around and see. We did start with two red and a blue. <laughs> not terrible hearts. <clears throat> Better than starting with like um like um three blue hearts or something or three green hearts. I would say. Oh, poison mushroom as well. Okay. We're looking pretty good right now. So let's take this one. Summons and duration. I kind of want to do... I kind of want to do this. That could be crazy. Um, I'll go this way. I mean, I do want cooldown. Oh, man. There's... There's two damage. Oh, and two attack speed. Holy smokes, dude. <laughs> it's actually crazy. Um... Holy smokes. Um, I think... Oh, man, dude. I think I'm going to go Poison Bomb. I think, I think I'm going to end up going Poison Bomb here. Um, I mean, they're both, they're both good. And then we go, like... We could go Revna. Or we could go Cards. I think I'm leaning towards going, um, potentially cards. We'll see, though. We'll see. Well, it also depends, because, like, we have minus 5% XP, so we're probably not going to get, like, a super crazy amount of XP. I mean, we're, we're also on normal mode, so, like, the odds of us getting a ton of XP, I feel like, are going to be slim to none anyways. But you never you never actually know, so we'll, we'll see how things go here. Um, we're not getting a lot of gold either, which is, I mean, that's been the, the trend. But now that we got Missing Unlocked, we could probably juice up the gold um, tree as well. I do want to save up, though, and try and unlock the uh, the 99 gold. I think that would be super nice to be able to go over 99 gold. So... We'll see, though. We will see. Okay. I mean, we're not sitting in a bad spot right now. Oh, blue heart, huh? Okay, we'll take that. Um. So this is, this is an interesting character. It just takes stuff from all the other characters. Um, I will take this. Um, I got a point in that. Let's max out damage, I guess. Boost speed for each heart. Attacks have a 15% chance to apply poison. 
<clears throat> I think I'm gonna go with the poison one. And we're gonna go poison bomb, dude. I think we're, we'll be sitting in a pretty good spot with this. <clears throat> um, cluster bomb. Okay. And then... I don't, I don't know what we're gonna go after that. We got a ton of freaking health pots on the ground. Holy smokes, dude. We can... We can stack up our, uh, well, if, if we can get hit, we can, we can stack up our, uh, healing for sure. I mean, we're about to fight the boss, so we'll see. We'll see how things go. Okay. Take a hit. And we'll run back here. Oh! Okay. I mean, more red hearts would be nice. Um, I mean, more blue hearts too, but... Poison enemies have, I mean, yeah, because we're going a crazy heavy poison build. Um, I guess I'll take this, even though, like, we can just take hits from that. Um, let's reroll. Stores a red heart. Swords spin around you. Shoots arrows. I mean, they both kind of, like, aren't very good. Um, I'll roll again. Something good. I mean, 50 gold, sure. Blue heart, sure. You, sure. Um... Let's roll again, I guess. Why not? Ooh. Ooh, I'll take this. This. And, yeah, we'll head out with 21 gold. Why not? Why not? Let's see what we got going on here. She what we got going on here. Um, I think getting hit is going to be the tough, uh, the tough thing. But, uh, we'll try. We'll try to get hit. Bam. Because, like, if we can get, like, I really want to try and get, like, over 100%. Um, I mean, we've already gotten over 100% damage, but, I mean, I mean, it is normal mode as well, but it's like, come on, the more damage, the better. Uh, sure, let's take this crit, why not? Like, we're on normal mode and we're already schooling kids, so I'm not, I'm not too worried on how, uh, things are gonna go here. Let's get that one. Let's get this. Um, let's just go, oh, we got projectiles unlocked, we definitely need projectiles. Like, the more projectiles, the better we'll be um, with this. So I definitely want to try and stack up as many projectiles as possible. As many projectiles as possible, the better off we'll be with this uh, run. So definitely going to try and do that. More the merrier. I mean, this run's already, like, 100%, like, done so. Like, we... I, I, we're not going to run into any problems going forward, I feel like. <laughs> like, I mean, maybe this guy, but it's like we, we melt him pretty quickly there. So, start making our way up toward uh, this guy up here. Hopefully it's something good. A golden Noki would be insane on this run. There's fireballs that deal damage and burn the enemies it hits. I mean, I guess it's not going to be super good for the build that we're going, but we'll take it, none the least. Um, I do want to max this out. I mean, maxing out duration can be good as well. Um, the limit of XP definitely is a little bit of a uh, little bit of a bummer, but I mean, what are you gonna do? I guess. Okay, I'm trying to get hit. <clears throat> Cause we got we got a ton of blue hearts. Like we can we can shut down some hearts, man. We can shred some hearts down <clears throat> if we can get hit. Oh my gosh, dude! Come on. There we go. Okay, 
<clears throat> Maybe that's the only hit that we're gonna get there. There's another. Okay. Stack those hits, baby. Stack those hits. Oh, there's a ton here. Yeah, baby, that's what I'm talking about. Gotta be careful, though, because, like, there's not a whole lot of uh, healing on the ground. I mean, there's, there's a good chunk, but not a whole lot. But it's crazy, because, like, the more times we get hit, the, more, the, the higher our damage increases, which limits, like... <laughs> Like, we're killing monsters faster, so us getting a uh, hit is, like, getting lower and lower. So, but we're trying. We're trying. Okay. There we go. And sure, I guess I'll take that relic. Why not? There, I'll get hit. Get hit again. Okay. I mean, we're looking good on the uh, damage portion. Come down here and get healed up, I guess. I guess. I mean, getting the two blue hearts is probably our next priority. In the tree, would be my guess. <clears throat> so when we pick up potions, we heal two blue hearts rather than uh, just the one. Is what I'm thinking. I mean, we're sitting in a pretty good spot right now. I mean, of course, more gold the better will be, so... I'm trying to get as much of that as possible. Okay, pick you up, and we'll run over here. Tons of gold right here. <clears throat> up to 51. Not bad. Grab that. I wipe him out pretty quickly. <laughs> Boss already? Holy smokes, dude. Take a hit. Okay. Okay. I'll pop this and uh, we just killed the boss, so we'll pick up that XP as well. Really pretty good. Not bad. Not bad at all. Uh, 62 gold. We're looking pretty good there. Um, increase the experience gain. Yes. Uh, I definitely want this. I want this. Um, Reroll. Uh, I'll take this. Pop it. Take this. Burn enemies have a 25% chance of throwing a fireball, plus 5 damage. Uh, sure, I mean, we are burning enemies, after all. Um, we're rolling would be pointless here. But I do want to jump over here and just start getting some points into this stuff. Damage and cooldown I'll definitely take. Attack speed, we'll juice that up. Um, and this, I definitely want the green heart one, because that will help us stack this up even more. Um... Because we're already up to 37.5. Um, yeah, I guess we'll take some duration. I'm tempted to go into damage in this again. And then attack speed could be crazy too. So, for the amount of hearts. And if we get maxed out hearts, like that could just be flipping insane. Um, <clears throat> I think I'm going to go with this one. Growth. Alright, I think, I think we're looking pretty good. I think we're looking pretty good. We're of course gonna still be pretty pretty unstoppable. Um, so getting hit's gonna be kind of tough, other than probably fighting the hitting the bosses. Uh, when they come around. Like we just got what two or three levels off of him. So not too bad. Uh, I do wanna make sure though that we get um, a bunch of health pots down before we start doing anything super crazy. Okay, so this is, uh, grants us an additional dash, which is super nice. Because I do be dashing a lot. Okay. I'm almost dashing, like, whenever it's up. 
Because, like, especially in normal mode, like, to get around quickly, like, dashing is super nice. I mean, in expert mode, not dashing as much. Because it is expert mode. But, I mean, normal mode for sure. Um, yeah, let's do damage. Okay. And then I think, yeah, this is the last altar. We could go to the gold mine, not that it's going to matter. Um, because we're about to fight the boss after this wave, so I'm not really too worried about that. Um... Other than that, we're looking pretty good, I'd say. Looking pretty good. Um... Okay, three off of that. But also getting the green heart one every, uh... Oh, there's another ring. Getting the green heart after every, uh... Like, 50 seconds is pretty good. Like, that's, that's a pretty good item to get, um, because we can, we can constantly get hit, and we'll be fine. I'm get hit a couple more times. Damage, ooh, area, yeah, that's huge. Um, 55% increased damage. I would like to try and get a little more, though. Tougher than I thought. Like, tougher as in, like, trying to get hit. So I'm trying. Oh my god. There we go. Okay. Seriously? Oh my gosh. Well, we got 46 points. Let's pump it into, uh, well, I actually, I, I really want to, um, let's take Revena. Go this way. Get this. I do want the attack speed. I'll take this as well. Helga's Brew. Um, increase damage. Increase this. Projectile speed. Attack speed. Um, duration we could go, but I don't think that's going to help a whole, whole lot. Um, I will juice this up as well, <clears throat> and hopefully we can get 10 more points. Okay. I mean, we're looking decent right now, but nothing too, too crazy. this. I think we got like six, eight points. Okay. Okay. Um, not terrible. Not super great. Um, I guess I'll pump it into this, into Revena. Okay. Um, cool. I'll probably smoke this guy pretty quickly. Would be my guess. Especially with all the, uh... Oh yeah, dude. He's got nothing on us. We're not smoking them as quickly as I thought we'd be smoking them, but I mean, we're still destroying them pretty quickly. But yeah, if y'all ended up enjoying this uh, episode, make sure you guys tap that like button down below. I'd greatly appreciate it. If you guys aren't in the channel, don't forget to subscribe. Every little bit counts, and I, like I said, it helps out the channel a lot, and I do, I do appreciate it quite a bit. Um, cool. That was that was actually pretty pretty easy. Um, get a health mastery from a random survivor. I don't know what that means. Get a dash mastery from... Well, I'd definitely rather get health. Interesting. Okay. Um, chaos. Build chaos constellation and upgrade it with the level cards you will get by leveling up. Each level card will give you a choice of several elements up to a maximum of five active relics, five passive relics, 15 stats, one ultimate ability when you reach level 50. Once the limit is reached, each level card will display random rewards. Oh, interesting. 
very, very interesting. We might go back to uh, Amaranth to try and check off some more Alfheim or even uh, try Half Grim again. But um, I don't know. We got uh, this new character, so we might just try him out in the next episode. But once again, this has been Nordic Ashes. Thank you guys all for watching. Hopefully you guys ended up enjoying. And uh, hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next episode. Peace out.